if you want to make your Windows 11 desktop look better and cool, well, you've clicked on the right video. Uh, make sure to subscribe and stick around till the end of this video to see how I did this. Now, let's go. Hi friends, today I'm here with another tutorial and in this video I'm gonna show you how to make Windows 11 better. I mean, for the, I want a better desktop and a cool desktop, that's what I wanna say when I say better. So without any further ado, let's go. So first of all, you, we wanna create our store point, as always and stick around till the end of the video if you want to see how to revert back to the state I am right now. So choose your drive, click on configure, turn on system protection and give it some size. Click on apply and then ok. Now click on create. You want to name the restore point, pretty much any name. I'm gonna name my take me back to Windows 11 and click on create and we'll just let it do its thing and we're gonna move on to the next step once this was created click on close and then click on ok here here are the files I'm going to use for today I'm gonna use the rounded taskbar rain meter and two rain meter skins don't worry, I'll put links in the description as always for you to download the files immediately, not having to dig the internet. So first I want to make the taskbar kind of better than this one. I mean, I kind of like the UI of Windows 11, but it's good. I'll like it after it. I'm currently extracting the contents of the around the taskbar and you probably guessed that we're gonna make around the taskbar so we're gonna open up the folder and we want to find this rounded tb.exe but I don't have file extensions on in order to find it click on view show file name extensions and here we go rounded taskbar.exe let's run the executable and here we have a round taskbar which it's kind of cool for Windows 11. This is not supposed to be in Windows 11. So now let's click on OK. And sure, I'm going to choose the margin to 3 and the corner radius to approximately 25. I'm going to apply it and I like it like this. Now I want to click on Advanced to change a few more settings. I want the dynamic mode. Um, and I'm gonna show the system tray in my case. I want a translucent compatibility and fill the taskbar when maximized. And now it looks kind of nice, but here's a little bug here which we can easily change, which fills by going to taskbar behaviors. We're gonna align it to the left. And now to the center, and now it looks better. If I, maybe you like the system tray showing up like this, if you don't want to, you wanna uncheck show system tray. And there you go. If you wanna show the system tray when you hover over here, you can do that. Now I'm just gonna show the system tray because I think it looks kind of unusual. Now we're just gonna close. And now we have a better taskbar. And now I'm gonna install Rain Meter here. So we can apply some other cool skins. And click a city user account control. And we wanna run Rain Meter. So now we 
wanna unload the skins because we don't really need them. We're gonna install our skins. So now I'm gonna refresh the folder and I'm gonna run the this one the Lumiro skin. I'm gonna do this. So here we have like Lock the date time we have the incorrect temperature, it's not minus 18 degrees Celsius. You might so, um, so these are gonna be easier to see if I change the background on here to more like this. Yeah, now we can see them a bit easier. So here is the date, here is the time, and this is this is not supposed to be minus 18 degrees Celsius. It's not winter in my city, so so now if you want to get a more clean look, I'm gonna hide the desktop icons. Keep it the time right here you can have and I'm gonna install the Monterey skin which is also another cool skin if you wanna try it out so now I'm gonna open up rain meter I'm gonna go to Monterey we've got widgets so here we have pretty much everything we want in the Lumiere team, but I'm just gonna the song info. I don't want that one. I'm gonna unload that one, and the weather forecast, which is not correct. And now in the Monterey skin, we have widgets, which we can use if we want to. So here we have timer, notes, reminders. So not bad if I just have the medium one, I'm gonna load that one. This is gonna be, this is Mac OS like, but it doesn't matter. I made a tutorial on, on how to make Windows 11 look like Mac OS. I'm gonna put it up in the cards. We have timer. I want volume here. I want a large one. can put it over here but I'm gonna unload it here I'm gonna put a medium timer you know just in case if we need it for something we have the, I kind of like the way and you can just type in anything test text and if you wonder what is this thing on the bottom like iPhone notch it's a PC manager with the toolbar on top. If you want to enable it, you need to open up PC manager and go to toolbox and enable it. It's pretty useful if you want to have it, you can just have it on here. And this now looks much better and more unique than Windows 11. What do you think? This is still Windows 11, but with a more unique look. We still have the same start menu, the search, the widgets panel, here, with no icons, and it's much cleaner, if you ask me. We can have it. One, we can add toolbar, we can pretty much have anything we want. So, anyway, thanks. You, thank you all so much for watching. And I'll see you all in the next video. Bye bye!